Greetings, YouTube. By the time this hits my channel, it is indeed late. Like past midnight Central Standard Time late. But I always say this, you know, I, I still don't work so hard on a daily basis for this channel because, well, how can I say this? I don't take for granted the privilege it is to make videos every day. And this privilege is actually in a way exemplified by trying to be a voice for injustice. But the other thing is you never know what stories you're going to talk about until you wake up or in this case, almost get ready for bed. If uh, you missed it, I did a video today talking about how everyone deserves the compensation that only a few people got access to today, which there was this really bizarre line that I don't remember ever seeing in a previous compensation package from Kabam, where they took into account like how much a player struggled with the previous side quest, and that was determining what rewards they got. And so, even though I did, like so many other people, a bugged side quest because I never used any units or maybe not even any items to get through it, I received nothing. I was not rewarded. In fact, I was punished for playing well and having a large roster. I would have been better off, according to the logic in that Kabam message, to just get face blocked into oblivion because the rewards were quite good including over 6,000 six-star shards, which so many people, including myself, could, you know, really use. But the problem got way weirder this evening, as those of you who know who you are tagged me on this on Twitter, but not just that, I got private DMs, including the line app, from my friend Blazer1, because this is currently in his inbox unclaimable. So you want to talk about a uh, torturous visual glitch. He has this top message, which should look very familiar because it is very similar to what we saw today in the inboxes of select few players. 2,000 side quest crystal shards, 6,500 six star shards, 6,500 five star shards. Uh, some percent, I think it might be a 25% tier 5 class catalyst fragment crystal, two uh, 6 star 6 stone crystals, two mystery objects, and over 1 million gold. Now, if that wasn't torture enough, underneath it, and this is not the only summoner to tell me he's seeing this, but it's certainly uh, somebody who's facing it, is the exact same compensation package, only this time... Kabam has upgraded the 25% Tier 5 Class Catalyst Fragment Crystal to 100% Tier 5 Class Catalyst Crystal. That's a big jump. Same amount of everything else, only instead of a mystery item here, it's two Tier 4 Class Catalyst Crystals, which, I always like to say this ironically, is double what you get for becoming a legend still in the game, I feel like everybody who's a legend now deserves way more than this retroactively, and then they should just make it way better, and I actually would have motivation for the first time in my channel's history to grind, say, a monthly event quest to get a legend title. Because I do think it's a cool thing, but it's also kind of nice being a man of the people, where most people who watch me I don't think are legends in the game, and so it just um, you know speaks to the fact that neither am I. Either way, Kabam has privately and I guess somewhat publicly on the forums, though not in the in-game inbox, apologized for the confusion. I am still hopeful that after all of this, we will get a compensation package. I don't know if it'll be this specific one, but we should get something. I just don't understand the logic behind punishing players who did really well in bugged content. If anything, Kabam should be saluting those players because, well, that's impressive. You shouldn't be punishing them because they did too well on content that was supposed to be easier. This entire thing is fascinating, and I know that there's an argument that people are only complaining because this exists, but they've been telling us that they're going to get us this for weeks. And I don't remember in the original post them saying that this was only going to be for people who got wrecked. So, uh, as always, I appreciate those of you reaching out. 
to give me a chance to make this video before bed. I will drop this on my channel while I get ready for bed. Um, you just never know what you're going to talk about, but after five years of doing this, it's, it's days like today that I just have to smile and think, I'm still glad that I'm able to do this and let people know the information. So thanks for the support. Have a good one.